Hey you guys, it's Rachel here with Sense of Tempo Cunny Corso. We've, oh sorry, Savannah was flushing the toilet. So I wanted to do a, a Mona update for you guys. Um, today was a rough day. I woke up and once again, I could see on her face she wasn't feeling well. And um, she was looking sadder than sad. She was looking sadder than sad, so. I um, <clears throat> took her temperature and it was 104.9, which um, was, you know, traumatizing for the both of us. Can you grab me a glass of tea, Savannah? Yes. Um, and so I rushed her to the vet, to the emergency vet, after I tried to cool her down. So we, gentle, Savannah, we, um, we... Took her and we, we got her wet. We wet her whole body down. And then I grabbed... Hey, Savannah, did you get that frozen stuff out of the truck? Oh, no, grab it. Thank you. <clears throat> I took a huge bag of frozen chicken wings and a bag of shrimp. A big bag of frozen shrimp. And I had Savannah alternate her body with the um, ice because um, the vet is an hour away. And... So we rushed her there, and um, her temperature dropped some. It was down to to 104.4, and um, and so they they basically decided that they were gonna change her antibiotic, and they recommended that I get a culture done to ensure that um, that we're getting the right antibiotic. Um, but they said that that I can. Um, you know, by by Monday, which is the soonest I'll probably be able to get her in, if that. Because um, that's like same day, so it might even be Tuesday. By then, we should know if this new antibiotic is working or not. Uh, I don't... Let me look and see what the name of it is. It's so expensive. <clears throat> Both of these medications. Well, mostly her size. So, it's Xenoquin. <clears throat> that's what they've got her on. And, um... So anyway, so as I was in there waiting, I was like looking and I was like, I researched Clavamox ineffectiveness just to see if I could find anything. And when it comes to staff, which is what the um, vet thought she had, um, uh, there are strains of staff that are resistant to Clavamox. So it isn't necessarily... Um, the the drug that I would have went with, um, a lot of vets, for example, like to recommend metronidazole for Giardia, but it, it it very rarely ever works. Has a very low success rate because most Giardia is um, is uh, resistant to um, to it, and it's also a pretty dangerous drug. Um, so anyway. They gave her some anti-nausea medication. Slide down. They gave her some sub-Q fluids. And then we've got her on this new medication. Quiet. And <clears throat> when I got home, she did eat. Watch out, Savannah. I'm trying to zoom in on her on her food. Is that, is that, um. I'm trying to see who it is. I'm trying to hard time seeing who it is. I don't think it's, oh, it's Venom. It's Venom. Grim. Grim. Yeah, it's Grim. I had a feeling. So there's her food. I've been mixing wet food into it just to get her to eat. And, um, when I, I, I got home or I got her home and I used a washcloth and that's why she looks a little bit wet right now. And I wet her down again and I've got the fan on high and I've got the windows open cause it's nice and cool outside. She's probably tired. And, um, I took her temperature when we first got here when it was 104.2 and now it is 102 points. What was it? 102.6. Which is pretty normal. I mean, it's it's not it's not it's not a fever. So now she's resting well. She drank a lot of water. Um, she ate a lot of food. That that bowl that bowl was full of food. Plus, it had two cans of wet food. So she ate a lot. So my anxiety is through the roof. It's been a really hard last couple of days, and um, not day drinking, but I might start. <clears throat> 
I'm, I was just the whole time just like trying to keep my voice in like monotone, like everything just calm, monotone. You were like, okay. Like, yeah, I was like, yeah, it was, it was very like, it's the only way I can keep my cool, um, in these kinds of situations because I just like think the worst, you know, like my brain just goes to the worst thing and I just flip out. And not like externally, I don't flip out. I don't like pull my head and like, bah! I don't make a bunch of noise or whatever. But, but emotionally and all that, I'm, I, I can really wreck myself a lot. And I know what, what a toll it takes on me emotionally. And sometimes it's unnecessary. You know what I mean? I'm just, just harming my body for no reason. And so I really have, have been trying, yeah. particularly with everything going on, to be more, um, to be more conscious and aware and protective of myself as well like to care enough about myself to not allow myself to to like you know um it's like she has like a severe like you guys know how anxiety works where you like tell yourself people are watching you and then you freak out well mom's like people are watching me 24 7 and like she doesn't think that but that's like kind of like how it works like if, you, if it was the same way like anxiety way it's like anxiety times 10 in her brain yeah when it comes to the dog moments. yeah 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 when it comes to the dog and like what they're going through yeah like it is very it, i basically yeah i do kind of have anxiety because i start to think about like for example yesterday i tried to express a little bit of the infection because i thought that it would be a good idea to get the infection out because that's what we had talked about right like reese and i and everybody like it's just kind of a thing you try to get the infection out so it doesn't abscess but then in my mind i was thinking oh my god what if there was like a pocket of like the poison or whatever the infection and it was in there and i just released it into like the bloodstream and now she's like gone septic and, and i'm and i'm just like freaking out internally thinking she's that smart, that like somehow i just killed my dog you know that. because of some normal she's smart. You're just like, and I, I definitely overthink, and I have to like tell myself to just like stop, you know what I mean, and just, and I have to like coach myself and literally be like, Rachel, did you mean to do it? No. Is it possible that that's what it could be? Sure. Is it going to change the outcome? No. Is it going to change the outcome to worry about it? No. Is it is it possible that it could not be that, and that you're just freaking out? Yes. You know, what, you know what like I do in my brain, I just tell huh. myself, can I fix this situation? No. All right, just let it roll. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, you just got to let it, you got to learn to just let go of what you cannot actively control. You know what I mean? Like, I'm, that I know that's her. Go get my baby. That's my baby, y'all. Anyway, I, I, um, I just... You know, I do. I've I've done what I can. You know what I mean. I've done what I can, and that's and that's all you can do. You know what I mean. That's who was crying. Let me see the chest. Yep, that's Bertha. That's Bertha. She's like, get off of me! Stop it! I don't want you now. Get off of me! Get off of me right now! Mm. Get my Dude, baby Mona. Like She's like, get off. Mm. Don't like you. I don't know who you are. Pick, don't let her eat that food. <laughs> Our carpet's dirty. I haven't vacuumed today, you guys. Okay. Yeah, we haven't vacuumed since last night. Hey, come here. Oh, no. Oh, wow. You want to fight? Yep, yeah. already. Yeah. Oh, you're raring to go. Yeah, you are. Oh, ah, no. Hey, hey. Oh, ow. No. Stop it. Stop. Ow. Oh, no. Stop. Yeah, I told you, you got to watch her, dude. She's, she's a hot one. She goes after me. Hey, I call her a furry piranha. Look at her. Hello. Thank you. Now go in. With your angry self. <laughs> You're a good girl, Mona. Oh, she's got her. You go away. Good girl. You go away, you little angry. Oh, stop it. 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 Stop it.
pursuing me. Oh no! Hi! Hi! Ow! You better get off of me, little brat. You little brat. Oh! oh. <laughs> she growling at you. No, 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 no! Ow! <laughs> I'm taking you down. No, Mona, you stay. Mona, 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 stay. Don't worry about that baby. Don't worry about that baby, Mona. You need to go to bed. She's like, no, that baby needs discipline. Mona, you're sick. Go to bed. Don't let her go because she can't no, nurse off her with that new medication. Mona Lisa. No. Hi, I used to hear Mona. No, you can't. Okay. Mona. No. Mona, go lay down. You're making her mad. Mona, come here. We know that's your baby. We know you love your baby. Come here. Probably why your milk won't shut off. You're too hormonal. Come on. No, Mona. Mona Lisa. Come here, baby. I wonder if her even being around her baby, hearing them cry, makes her produce milk. Because you know how you said that? I can't, I can't have her out, though. There's just yeah, nothing I can do no, about that. No, I know that. that. But you know how... You said that mother, like, you would produce milk if you heard a baby cry. Mona Lisa? Yeah, Mona, I would, yeah. Stop it. Go away. This is my baby. <laughs> Mona, this is my baby. Mona. Yeah, we can't, we can't let her go because... Sven, go put that baby up. I know. Mona, Mona needs to go to bed, and I don't want her worrying about this baby. Um, she's just, hello, she's just, she's just going to have to deal with being by herself right now. Anyway, I've got to go, you guys, I've, I've, we've got to clean up this house. It is sheer chaos in here. It's filthy. And, uh, we just been running around like crazy today. Yeah, get her out quick. Don't let her in there. Okay. And, um, I got to go to the grocery store and get her cabbage. Baby girl, come here. Mona, Mona Lisa, come here. The white spots are where I tried to give her some wormer today. Come on, Psst. up. Come on, Mona, up. Come on, up in here, come on. Come on, baby girl, come on. Come up onto the quilt. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. It was a little, it was a little tart, if you will. Oh, baby, sugar bear, come on, honey. Get up here, come on. Come on, baby. Up and up. Mona, come on, baby girl. Come on. Up, 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 up. Anyway, come I'm going to let... Come on, 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 come she says no. So she does. She's a baby. Mama baby. Mm. Kisses. Mm. You shot dog. Man. Anyway. All right, you guys. Well, I'll keep you guys updated. But please keep Mona in your prayers, you guys. I'm going to try to get her into... Good Lord. I'm going to try to get her into the vet as soon as I can to get a culture made. And uh, so we can attack this thing the way that we did with Zoe. Knowing exactly what we're going after. Um, so anyway, I hope you guys have a good day and I'll, I'll talk at you later. Bye.